Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So today on the um, Lenovo Legion Go, we're taking a look at FC24, EA Sports FC24. Um, let's see what settings we've got going here. Okay, display config, we're at 1000p, full screen, 144 hertz, 120 frames per second, vertical sync off, dynamic resolution scale off, cutscene quality is off rate, so you'll see it will drop down to 30 frames per second for cutscenes, strand based is off, render quality medium, grass quality medium, crowd quality low, Let's see what kind of performance we get with these settings. And then obviously we're at 30 watt um, performance mode. Okay, so you can see we're hovering around 59 and 70 frames per second. Cutscenes are now only down to 35 frames per second. Cutscene, so we drop down to half, it's around 30 frames per second, and then once we're back to gameplay. And he's fired over the corner. You can see we're up to 51 so frames per second, 57. Can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done 60 frames per second. Well, they should be ahead now. Pretty yes, smooth experience. So one thing I couldn't do is play with the SD card, knowing um, on the Asus ROG Ally we've got an SD card issue. Um, but on the Lenovo Legion Go I am playing FIFA off of the SD card. This game seems it seems to be holding up fine. Rafinha. 
Pena. And the keeper there to deal with it. So a half an hour remaining. Now maybe room here for the counter attack. Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. I know I've seen on Reddit a lot of people complaining now. about the Lenovo Legion Go's SD card slot um, stuttering in game. So I think it's a hit and a miss for me personally. Um, there's certain games that require SSD level reads and writes. But the SD card in its current state, there's some games that it's playable. Manageable. Well, could really get up the opposition. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Will he play it in? Vinicius Jr. Well, he tried to put everything into the shot, but couldn't find the target. Substitution for Real Madrid. I feel like in my experience on FC24, um, where the most fluid, let's say, graphics pop up, that you kind of see a little snag, a little hiccup, those EA FC graphics as it's transitioning from cutscene to gameplay. Those come in and out of screen quite fast, so I think that stutters if you, you're playing off an SD card. Currently got a SanDisk um, SD um, installed in the device. I'll do a subsequent video, um, just transfer the game from the SD card to the internal Len Lenovo Legion Go's um, SSD hard drive and see um, what kind of performance we get there as well. So keep an eye out, um, subscribe to the channel, hit that like button for when that video gets published to the channel.
just 10 minutes to go. Modric. Modric. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. Well, he's certainly been warned, Stuart. No more challenges like that. Well, he's in no doubt now. He can't foul again. Valverde. Great ball over the top. What a block! Oh, I think he'll be kicking himself. Ruled offside. Well, his instinct should have told him he was offside there. He has to be more alert in the box. Okay, I think that's going to do it for today's video, guys. Do hit that like and subscribe button. Appreciate the support the channel's been getting. Um, you can see it's quite a solid experience on the SD card F FC24 has been played off of. Um, like I said, I'll do a subsequent video of how it performs on the internal S SSD hard drive. Um, till next time, cheers.